just after his brazen VBIP arrogance was caught on camera, BJP MLA Arbin Limbabli has now landed into more trouble. In a video tweeted out by Karnataka Congress, Limbabli was seen interacting with a regional news channel on his brazen arrogance with a woman. He says, and I quote here, she has encroached land. You let that go and say this and that. Have I raped her? Unquote. The Congress has hit out and questioned Chief Minister Burmai's silence. My colleague Nagarjun Dwarkanath is now joining me live on the story. Absolutely shameful, Nagarjun. He, of course, was arrogant earlier with the woman who was seeking his help and then of course the police lodged an FR against the woman in the case and now he seems absolutely defiant and says what have I done wrong? Have I raped her? Follow me, that's absolutely true. In, in fact, uh, instead of apologizing to the public and to the woman about his brazen act of aggression and thuggishness, uh, he goes on to be defiant and says have I raped her? Why is the media behind me? What, what wrong have I done? Once again, our netas have let, her, let us down by using the word rape uh, with free will. Look at the uh, attitude of the MLA here, who is a public representative. He said, why is the media questioning me instead of questioning her who has encroached the land? Instead of questioning her, you have come back to me to an and take, take answers from me. Have I raped her? What have I done wrong? I just snatched the papers. With such uh, free, free will that he used the word rape without any uh, proper thought uh, behind it, the public representative is clearly here, uh, is brazen and defiant about his behavior and with aggression that we saw previous day and now he's still defiant. Instead of apologizing and extending a sorry face to the public here, the MLA stands his ground and says, I have not done anything wrong. Did I even rape her? And that's the brazen comment that the MLA has made today. And the police, of course, has lodged a case against the woman in this matter, whereas she was seeking help from him. He was abusive. He, in fact, did... Uh, in fact snatched papers from her hand as well but the police went on to lodge a case against the woman okay the woman, Nagarjun, uh, just hold on for a minute we earlier spoke with Shankara Guha Karnataka Congress leader let's listen in okay we will uh, now we will just bring Nagarjun in but Shankara Guha Congress spokesperson is on the phone line with us right now I believe uh, Mr. Guha, how do you react to this video which has been of course uh, tweeted out by the Karnataka Congress itself where you can see Arvind Limbavli almost defiant. So earlier he misbehaved with the woman. The woman was booked by the police uh, and now here you can see when he's interacting with the regional news channel he says, why are you after me? Did I rape her? Unfortunately, remember about uh, a month ago. His daughter was also involved in a similar fight on the road. Police given her uh, the cuts uh, or the courtesy to file a case against her and question her instead. They let her off in spite of her blatant uh, misuse of uh, words and power and what not. Arvind Limbawali is a senior man. He has been an MLA for more than a couple of times. He's been a minister. And uh, this is not the problem with just um, Mr. Arvind Limbawali. This is the problem with BJP. In Karnataka, they've got two chop of in their heads and uh, they think they are invincible. You know, this is not just one-off incident. This is happening repeatedly. And Arvind Limbawali and his family also, yep. they are one of the most arrogant people. This is not... And you, if you see the way he has behaved with the media, you know, it is he is guilty. It is more than obvious he is guilty. I think... Uh, the BJP central leadership should take this matter very seriously, call these people and warn them. Otherwise, already they have lost the state. They are going to lose it in an even more worse manner. Absolutely. And like you point out, it runs in the family, or so it seems, because earlier we had seen a few months ago a video of his daughter misbehaving with traffic police because they were fining her for over speeding at that point of time and here subsequently you see the father 
in fact uh, snatching papers from a woman's hand, abusing her, misbehaving with her because she was trying to seek his help and completely unrepentant about that behavior. And the language that he has used is terrible. And the language that he has used. I mean, if he had the, if he had something to question, if he had an issue with her, there are always better ways and better means to have a discussion. This is not the way. You can't just rough up with somebody for no reason. Right. Mr. Guha, thank you so much for speaking to India today. Let's listen in to what Arvind Limbavali said, completely defiant and unrepentant. <laughs> I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to go to the house.